Hey there, true believers. Rank is Frog. You're the ones with Pokemon Heart Gold. Last time we we inter inter interrupted Misty's date, beat her up, and now we're here in Celadon to ruin someone else's day. Once I figure out how like perspective works. This gym sucks, by the way. I really uh. It's, uh, it's very, very tricky in how to navigate this place. Oh no, Skip Loom. The most dreaded Pokemon in all of Pokemon. Let's flamethrower it. Skip Loom is lame. Uh, Hopip is more lame. Jump Bluff is fine. I don't, I don't care for the line. Just put it out there, really. Very nice. We need all those you can muster, Typhlosion. 128 special attack, though. It's only gonna help you. Speaking of Hoppip being lame, look at Hoppip. Look at how lame you are. Lava Plume. I'm not even gonna use Flamethrower on you. I'm not even gonna bother. Goodbye, Hoppip. Ah, hello, Jump Luff. Rocking the whole line then. You get a flamethrower. It's just Hop It that's terrible. <laughs> oh, blah. Yep. Sounds about right. Alright. And we go... All the way up here. Kinda, yeah. Well, Misty's was mostly girls only. There were the two sailors who were hanging around. Ah, good job. I wasn't sure if that was gonna if that was gonna be a one shot or not, but very good job, Typhlosion. Alright. We go up and around here. Fight this trainer. She's a beauty who talks in a deep voice. Sounds legit to me. Why not? Why she has bug Pokemon in a grass gym is beyond me as well, but... Oh well, they go down with the same attacks anyway, so... Doesn't really matter. I just hope Typhlosion gets at least one level out of this place. Because... At least one more level, rather. Carnivine. I don't think I know this one, actually. Oh no, I remember you. I remember you. You're from, um... Diamond Pearl, aren't you? Think. Well, doesn't matter anymore, though. Goodbye, Carnivine. I'm not gonna judge. It's not my not my not my life, and I'm not and I'm not leading it. It's... There we go. 
This, <laughs> this gym is hard to get out of. Now, let's see. How are you looking as far as moves go? Oh, you're fine. You're fine, Typhlosion. You're fine. Wasn't sure how he would be, um, move-wise. I thought, I thought his PP might be a little low. That's actually fine, though. I have nine uses of Flamethrower. I suppose. It's sunny in-game. It's miserable in real life, but, you know. Yeah, it's, it's kind of why I'm here, Erica. <laughs> I would certainly hope you've trained in, in battle, because you are, you are the gym leader. Oh, Erica. Love her sprite, that's adorable. Oh, hello, jump off. I'll be finding something that's actually that actually matters, but no, just just jump off. Goodbye, jump off. I assume goodbye, jump off. Yes. Okay. <laughs> That'd be really funny if I arrogantly called out, uh, "Bye, jump off," and then it survives. <laughs> That'd be awkward. Tangela. All right. Bring out your weird hentai monster, and I shall flamethrower it. Hopefully this will take it out, I actually don't have a- oh, cool, very, very good then, Typhlosion. Very good. I didn't think that would work. Thought it would have, like, yellow health left, because Tangela is very, is very sturdy. Victrabell, this is one. Oh, Jesus Christ, 56. Oh, we're still faster than that, though. Good job, Typhlosion, being so fast. <laughs> it's only gonna help you here when you're six levels down. <laughs> still a one hit kill, though. Still a one hit kill, though. Very, very impressive, Typhlosion. Uh, Victrabell is one of uh, is one of two is one of two of Erica's uh, trademark Pokemon. Uh, it used to be Victra, uh, Victrabell Vileplume, but now that Blossom is a thing, Blossom replaced uh, Vileplume. So, Blossom is an interesting Pokemon. I, f I think it evolves from Bloom with a Sunstone in it. I think that's how it works. And it's surprisingly sturdy. Are you going to heal out of the red? Oh, you did. Oh, that's so unfortunate for you. Oh, that's even worse for you. Why would you do that? It's the, that's the worst thing you could have done. <laughs> I know what you're doing, but that's the worst thing you could have done. See, what she's doing is uh, uh, is uh, is using Sunny Day to set up for every turn Solar Beam, because Solar Beam uh, normally ha uh, has uh, uh, has one turn of charge up, and then you unleash the second turn. If it's it, uh, uh, if you, uh, uh, if it's uh, if the sun is shining brightly though, a la Sunny Day, you don't have to charge. You can just you just fire Solar Beam, and you can fire it again next turn and again and again and again. So that's what she's trying to do. But all she did was just make me stronger. Oh, but she's faster than me now. Oh, well, there you go, then. That's Solar Beam. It's very powerful. See? Oh, that, oh, oh, that was a crit, though. So that's not... That's not a fair estimate of power, but... It is a very strong move, so... I'm not surprised that it just chunked Typhlosion that badly. But we're also stronger, because Sunny Day makes... Uh, Sunny, Sunny Day makes fire, makes fire attack stronger. So... That was not wise. And there was Erica. Just a little bit. Me and Typhlosion. Yeah. Hmm, what's TM19? 
I don't rem actually I do oh, I, I was gonna say actually I do remember it's Giga Drain. Giga Drain is really, really good, so Yes, it's very, very strong. And and as she said, it heals you for half uh, for half the damage dealt. Fair enough. Now it's time to get out of the gym. The true trial of the Celadon City Gym. Getting the hell out of the Celadon City Gym. <laughs> okay. But I think, at least from here, we can just do this and get out. Ha <laughs> ha! Alright. Yep. In the original games, he uh, he uh, uh, he was out there saying, "He he, this gym is great. It's full of beautiful women." He <laughs> he, because he's an old pervert. But they've censored him just to be a weirdo now, instead of a blatant upfront pervert. So that's cool. At least they did that. Let's go. Oh, it's not that way. The city changed in its design from the original games. I get turned around a little bit. And the way that I see it, we have two options now. We can go down Cycling Road to Fuchsia City. Actually, three options. Sorry, three options. Three entire options. We can go that that way, down Cycling Road. We could go down the pier uh, past, uh, past Ver uh, Vermilion down to Fuchsia that way. Or we can try to go through Mount Moon back to Pewter City. I don't know which one I want to do. Let's see if I can go back. To, let's, let's, see, let's see if I can go back uh, back to Pewter City. I'm interested to see if I can, because then I can go fight Brock, and Brock will be easy. <laughs> That's my only reasoning. I just want to go fight Brock because he's easy. <laughs> All right, let's throw Nido King up front though, because Nido King hasn't been getting a lot of love. Nido King or Politoed, really. And I want Nido King to get some love. So. <sighs> city city designs have changed and I get confused. Now I think I can go this way. Oh, I can't. Okay, never mind. I thought I could. I, th I thought they added new paths to let you go back there from here. And I guess not. So, never mind. Guess we're not gonna go. Guess we're not gonna go back to Pewter then. We have to go south. That's fine though. We'll, uh, we'll go down Cycling Road. It'll be easy. It'll be cool. You guys will love it. Alright. To Cycling Road. Um, through that path is the house you got, uh, you had to go through to get cut. Oh. Oh, sorry. Am I good now? Okay, let's go. <laughs> Glad that's all it took. Let's go. Whee! Take your hands off, take your hands off the bars and just go! Sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> that sounds dirty. Please don't. Oh god, they're twins. This is a solid party for this. Um... Uh, I have to, I have to, I have to do that though, which upsets me. I want, I want to do earthquake, but it'll hurt Espeon, so I, I shouldn't. But that's, uh, that's it for Krogunk, though. So, at least there's one less Pokemon for us to have to contend against. And I think now it's uh, going to be two on one now, because I think that was Dan's only Pokemon.
Oh, you poor dear. Can I, can I pull Espeon back, make it one-on-one -on -one again? I feel like I want to do that. Can't do that? Ah, uh, let's just store an attack. Nido King can only do so much against against other poison types. If I if I didn't have Espeon out, I could Earthquake, but at this point it's kind of moot, so it's better just to uh, not let Espeon be savaged by Earthquake. <laughs> And second verse same as the first. Except this time, we just psychic and not waste the PP on horn attack. Neat. Uh, I do have another. I do have. Do have. I do have a different attack that's gonna take up a horn attack space. So don't worry. We will we'll be, we'll be. We'll be getting rid of it at some point. Unfortunately, it's not for a while. But we'll get rid of it, and it'll be a much more useful ability. <laughs> All right. Thanks. For kicking my ass. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> Whee! All right, that was fun. All right. Good to know, Charles the Biker. Wouldn't you go by Chuck if you were Charles the Biker? I don't think coughing is levitating. It is. Okay. Never mind. Ow. Please don't. Dick. <sighs> Poor Nito King. Uh, Polytoad. Poor Nito King. Being exploded. Well, let's, let's surf. You're just going to explode too, aren't you, though? Oh, wait, Polytoad, a Polytoad can't be exploded on. That's right. Poly, a Polytoad has an ability that allows him to not be exploded on, which is pretty cool. At least as far as I'm understanding the ability. I may be wrong, but it's very handy if so. Uh, no, actually, we're fine right here. And let's surf. I think surf is gonna be better against Charmeleon anyway. I think he's more of a physical uh, tank versus a uh, special. So doesn't matter. All right. Thought there was going to be a Snorlax I'd have to uh, fight to get down here. But apparently not. And welcome to Fuchsia City. Fuchsia City, the gym leader here, is poison type. So, we can prepare for some poison gym. Which is, what, which, which is why I'm going to be using Nidoking. Because Nidoking is, A, immune to being poisoned, so toxic is useless, which is a big thumbs up. Uh, second, it, he's ground, which is good against poison, which is great. And, uh, he takes less damage from poison attacks. So, all in all, Nido King should be perfect for this gem. That being said, I'm actually going to call the video a little bit early, and I'm going to go train Nido King against the bikers, uh, because there's a lot more bikers for us to beat up. And Nido King needs some needs some EXP and some levels before I even try this. So with that, I hope you guys had fun, and I will see you next time with, 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 more, with more Let's Play Pokemon Heart Gold, where we will go into the Fuchsia City Gym and wreck shop. I, I wonder who the gym leader is since Koga's in the Elite Four. Hmm. 
Well, we'll find out next time. So, till then, till then. Okay? Out.